Hey everyone, it's Jennifer and today I am in Emeryville, California. Shout out to all my Cali girls and I'm at the Biosance headquarters. Like, they invited me to come into their lab and see how all the products are made. I like skincare that's clean myself, but I imagine this to be like your own little personal kitchen. So imagine all the ingredients in their little planters. There's probably gonna be like oranges and rose and I think it's gonna be awesome to kind of see what it looks like. I'm interested to see what, how all the products are made and I can't wait to have you come along with me. All right, y'all, I just got to the lab. It's super official in here, so I feel like I should whisper and not talk super loud, but I'm excited to see what's inside. Who do we have here? Say hi. Hi. I'm Jennifer. Jennifer. Nice, oh, nice to, meet to meet you. you. Awesome, and I'm here to see Ramya. Okay. Right up this way. You have okay. to put on a lab coat and then we'll be so on So official. Way. Coat check. Glasses check. Hi Ramya, it's so nice to meet you. Can you tell me a little bit about what you do here? Of course. So I work in the product development team for Biosan. I'm responsible for putting all of our formulas together from start to finish, from concept to shelf. Kind it's of amazing. All the ingredient selection, um, product performance, textures, um, usually working on that. Yeah, how long have you been working here? A couple years. Wow, that's yeah. absolutely amazing. And then what is your favorite part about your job? Um, being creative and being able to make something that I eventually get to use. That's great to hear. Can we see how you make one of the products here? Of course. So today we're going to work on our Omega Repair Cream. So the idea behind this kind of had to do with um, we had a lightweight moisturizer called our, our probiotic gel moisturizer. I love that one. Um, really lightweight. We got a lot of feedback of folks who just wanted something a lot richer. Um, so we wanted to make a more heavy duty moisturizer for super dry skin. Um, and the inspiration behind it is, you know, when we're thinking about how to make a product special, is that our skin already has a certain barrier function and it has a yeah. lipid barrier, right? So that's composed of squalene, um, essential fatty acids, ceramides, um, cholesterol. So we wanted to kind of take that protective layer um, and make a cream out of it. Yeah, it sounds like you're putting all the good ingredients back into our skin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, and then could you tell me a little bit more about the good fats? I love the bad fats. I'm a uh, huge lover of French fries. Yeah. I'd love to hear more about it. Of course. Um, so we do have tech triglycerides going in. Um, we have these plant-based sterols. Um, we didn't want to use cholesterol, so we okay. that comes out of acai that works very similarly. Um, then we have ceramide for restructuring um, and replenishment. We have hyaluronic acid going in. Ooh. Yeah. So. <laughs> I would love to see how it's made. Okay, let's get started. Yeah. So I've already added in um, our water and our hyaluronic acid okay. because we want water soluble moisture. So yes. we have our humectants up front. Now we're going to add our oily components, meaning our essential fatty acids, sterol, ceramide, and squalene. Yeah. So our squalene, of course, because we need that emollient. That's what kind of gives you breathable moisture. Yeah. Um, we have some glycerin and some hyaluronic acid because we also want water soluble moisture. Um, these are our ceramides. Um, this helps with just your skin's barrier function, it keeps the water from getting out. Um, Walk in the moisture. Yeah. <laughs> and then these are our plant sterols. They're very sticky. We want to use something plant based because normally you'd be using cholesterol and that always comes from animals. Yeah. We prefer not to do that. So. Similar to the squalane, right? Correct. Yeah, okay, good to know. You guys are very conscientious about the products that you use mm -hmm. and the ingredients. We are. So, into the mixture we go. Do you have a favorite ingredient of this product? I would say, I always like putting hyaluronic acid in everything. It's just, um, gives a lot of moisture. Of course, squalene, I can put it neat and it just sort of makes the cream feel a lot more decadent as well. Yeah. So, yeah. Give you that natural glow. Yeah. <laughs> now that we've learned all about this product, I have to try it. Is that? It's so creamy. Mm -hmm. It just dissolves right into the skin. Yeah. What's nice is that it's rich, but it still absorbs pretty quickly, so it yes. doesn't feel super heavy or greasy. Exactly, and it's not leaving like a greasy or oily feel afterward, which is really, really nice, especially for someone like me that's a little more on the oiler side. Hey Biosance fam, I just finished an awesome tour with Ramya. She got to show me all the cool stuff in the lab and I truly cannot believe 
how much goes into making these products. They're like super clean. I thought you could just do this at home, easy DIY, but there's truly so much more to it and I'm amazed. And this right here is my jam. It's gonna be in my routine every single day and I hope you guys love it too. Um, if you had a good time watching, there's gonna be more episodes. Please subscribe to our channel and we can't wait to see you next time.